Here we are, Capstan up on Hull. We need to get some Scarrywinkles, but mainly we're here to try and find a someone who can build us a boat. We need a boat to progress the game by the looks of things. And this is a shipbuilders. Let me have a look. Got a handful of clams? Oh my god, is there anything better than a handful of clam? <laughs> <laughs> There's very few things in this world better than that. Who is this? Auto shop. Maybe you can sell the scarrywinkles. Hey up, good to see ya. Hey up, love. Hello, stranger. We don't get many visitors round these parts. I suppose you'll be wanting to spend night, will you? I'll only charge you twenty gold for pleasure. Bye, then. No thanks. I'm after a shop to sell some scarrywinkles. You there. This looks like a shop. Alright mate, I'm stood on your table, what are you gonna do? Hey up. Hey up lad. Come do a spot of shopping, have you? Well, I've not got a lot to offer. But feel free to take a look at me ways. What'll it be? Not... Come back again. Come back again. Now these guys have got fackle. Got fackle, mate. I thought I'd be able to buy these. Never mind. How are you? Sell me a boot. Hmm. Oh, how do? You'll be this King Evan all Puggy told us to expect, eh? Hello. That's me. Mm. Well, you're a bit shorter than what I was imagining, but nice to meet you, Your Majesty. Name's right. I'm to gaff around these parts. Puggy told me what you were after, but I'm not best fixed to help you just now, if I'm honest. Oh. Really, has something happened? Oh, aye. You could say that aye. It were a few days back now. A load of old boats were fi out fishing when a monster showed up and smashed a lot of empty bits. A bunch of two young'uns went looking to snicker sneeze the thing, but the poor blokes haven't been since. And I'd half a mind to go after Tereckless Wally's mess. Messen? Wally's messen. But I'd only get a wallop like as not. This guy is talking complete tallywackle, <laughs> tallywackle. So that's where everybody went. Oi! Hey Evan, if we help them out, they'll owe us a favour, won't they? Yes. Yes, and besides, we can't very well leave them to do their fate. Sorry, leave them to their fate. Mr. Wright, we we'll go and see what's happened to the other villagers. Oh, oh, oh. Shrop, really? You do that? Well, go on then. I'll not turn down an offer of help. The horrible thing lives in an old shrine down coast. I only hoped lads are alright. But he smashed them boats up like they were now. Watch yourselves, eh? Is that a, a Yorkshire accent? I don't know what accent I was doing. <laughs> fucking wasn't Yorkshire but I gave it a crack anyway so Evermore's coming along very nice the flora of cow oh we've seen them and a sinister scene Ooh, where's that the dark water that flowed there served to chill the air I've never seen that right, hold on I want to check out where I get these scallywinkles scallywinkles Has been taking spear lessons. Uh, she really wants to give them something in return. I thought I'd be able to buy them here, but evidently not. Maybe we can buy them when we get the, the staff members back. Did I get that? They, I need a broadsword. Defeat the Wamstack Clangers. I need to defeat another four of them. Grimchiller Bangers. 
So I'll, may, I'll go out of my way to do them for those tokens of gratitude. I just need to remember them. I didn't even know that third slide was there, to be fair. Um, this is what we're doing now. The Briny Shrine. So where's the Briny Shrine? Oh, well, we've been to the, we've actually been in the Briny Shrine. It's just outside of here. I kind of, I don't think, I don't know how far we got into the Briny Shrine, but I'm sure I went Gosh. in there. Hey up, hey up, love. I don't know if there's any tainted creatures. Um, map. So I'm here. There is a. Whoa, 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 whoa. Rainy Shrine. I've definitely been there. I wonder if I can get the Starboard Isle via that thing. Small island right in the centre. I doubt it. But let's go to Briny Shrine. I think we can go around this way. I don't think there's any Wamsters around here. Clangers and bangers we need to kill. We're in the complete wrong area for that. That dragon. What level was that dragon? Is there a reason why we didn't fight it? Because it's a 55, that's why. Come on! Absolutely one add. Ooh. Are you scurvy landlubbers? Let's avoid this. Pork chopper. We're gonna have to fight him. is hitting still right in his face. It's the best way. Oh, I forgot we've got our own little... we got a new little... what's it called? Higgledy. The little... what does it look like again? I forgot what Higgledy we got. Oh yes, it's the little yellow one that looks like a sunflower. I like it. Oh, I remember what's in this in the Briny Shrine. There was there was just an altar, and we couldn't do anything at all there. That's why we left. That's right. So it, it clearly is a, a story, a story area. Yeah, that's it. There was an altar, and there was nothing I could do with it. I think we'll save in case it is a boss, because it does look like a boss room, like to be fair. And apparently, there's supposed to be a monster residing here. No doubt I'll absolutely cave its face in. But, let's see. Oh, here we go. Hmm. Can't help but notice a glaring lack of shipbuilders. Did the wretched creature gobble them all up, do you think? Hey! Over there, do you see? There's something on top of the platform. Oh, yeah. Let's go and take a look, closer look, shall we? I already know what it is, because I've been here, son. Oh. What exactly is it? Uh. Some kind of cocoon or egg or something. Oh, shh. What? What's that? It's like aliens. Blimey. There's somebody in there, isn't there? Oh my gosh, there's some someone inside it. You mean to say there's people in them? Every one of the blessed things.
Oh, it's a spider. Do you think it's going to be a big spider? Then we best get the poor swabs out. Hmm. Careful. We're not alone. It's a weird octopus. The Jelly Queen. Gruesome Grand Dame of the Glowing something. I missed it. Get him! Oh, we've destroyed him. <laughs> I'm gonna cut your legs off and make crispy squid legs. Come on, we have to free them. Catch! E thank crikey! E thank crikey! Where are they? I thought I was a goner. You bred that beast a good and proper, eh? Right tasty you are. Not like us lot. Is everybody safe? Mr. Wright was awfully worried about you all. Ha! I bet he were. There'll be no getting done with us all gummed up here. We better get back sharpish or we'll never hear the end of this. Ta right all lad, ta-da for now. See you back at Capstan, eh? All right. All right. Capstan it is. Capstan it is. Did we get any loot from that? Nothing. But I do want to investigate if I can go and get that tainted creature. I don't think I can cross the water. That's probably too deep. But it might be a walkway. There, look. I don't think we'll be able to jump. Nah, we can't jump across that little island. There's no way it's too far. Do you think? We'll try it. I'm interested to see if we can. I might have already tried this, like. Watch this. Charge! Look at him, that's my favourite one, look at it. The little yellow, little bobble head. Bevo laddie, got more head than he got baddie. A queasy hybrid bow, maybe we can use that. Hold on, does that mean I can give that to... Show no beer hybrid bow, grade... Grade 5 or higher, where, where does it even tell you that? Grade 5. Oh, the stars. How many stars it is? Must be. Grade 5 or higher. Right, never mind. Can we get over here? Nah, denied. Okay, let's travel back to Capstan. Ta da! Oh! Hey, up, Your Majesty. The lads are back safe and sound. You've done Capstan up on all oh, a right big favour, and then some. <laughs> you should have seen him, righty. The kid's a flipping animal. 
clobbered that thing what snatched us up like it were now. Bosh. <clears throat> Who you calling a kid, you sackless oaf? Well, oh, I've completely lost the accent there. This isn't some bane from down road. It's a king. King Evan Ode Ortlands. I'll have you know. Whoa! Shrop. A king and all, at his age. But what's some king over till and far away don't come in to rescue likes of us? We need shipbuilders. And Mr. Wright told us his shipbuilders needed our help. So that's it, eh? Well, King Evan. If it's boat builders you need, you've found your blokes. What are you after exactly? A night's fishing boat maybe? Or some to live in? We can do you a right good houseboat if you need a one. We need something big and hard wearing. We plan to sail around the world. Hydropolis first and then, well, who knows? Ha, <laughs> <laughs> round flipping world eh? Sails like now. Well, I'd hate this point, yeah, but you'll not get an ocean going boat out of any of the wood we got round here. No, you'll be needing something proper hard wearing. The waves will soon wallop you to pieces otherwise. Hmm. Hard wearing wood, hmm? I think we'd better go and speak with Niall. You'll know something we can use, I'm sure. Willie, now. Well, you'd better go and ask your mate Niall then, and let us know when you've had word with him. Oh, aye. Aye. Doing all. We have a debt of gratitude to be paying you back. Oh, look, a big whale. The Charming Chaffinch? A fiery leathery glory. If you ask me, it's more beautiful than the fairest pirate S. Hmm. Never seen one of them before. So we'll go and speak to Ni in the Nial, Nial, whatever he calls himself. Okay, but what I want to do is... There's one thing I'm interested in that I've never actually checked. This one, the Dream has Mazes. Does this actually show you where the mazes are, or does it not? Oh, it says the next one's... Says the next one's in that middle island, which I can't get to. Okay, that's a shame. Scary winkles. I didn't even know where to get them. Oh, unless that's from the creatures lying in the ocean, which I can't get to yet. Okay. I'm going to kill them. Four clangers and eight bangers. And I need a broadsword still. Clangers and bangers. Let's teleport. Two. I think there are clangers and bangers outside of here. I'm sure there's some here, you know. Clangers and bangers. If not, I know there's some outside of gold pole. There's a clanger. So I need one more clanger, eight more bangers. There's a banger. Watch your back. Six more bangers. There's a... is that a banger? I think that's a banger. Yep. We need six more of these ones. Oh, we're getting them all here. There's clangers and bangers. Watch this. See you. 
massive mullet. Done. Two more bangers. Here goes nothing. I didn't see any bangers there, like, did you? Got it. I still need a broadsword. Do you even know where to buy one from? Hold on. Broadsword. Sky Pirates base. I'm gonna go there. Surely you can buy a broadsword from here. There's got to be a merchant that sells them. That's not a merchant, that's a... Right, maybe he's downstairs. Oh, well, if there's not here, I know where there is a merchant. Coil Canyon. There. Hopefully he's got a random broadsword. This guy. All right. Welcome. He hasn't got. Let's see if we have what you're looking for. Please come again. I need... How... Why is it so hard to get a broadsword? Like, who even... Who even has them? I don't know of any more shops. The forest of... Now. There's no one there. Hideaway Hollow, Gold Paw, Capstan, I'll tell you what, we'll go to Fortin Square and we'll turn these two quests in. We'll just have to find a broadsword somewhere else. But we'll probably end up finding one just... Ah, then will we? Because it seems that the broadswords are a really early game weapon. And we haven't found any for ages. Where's the guy? Oh, he's just down this path. There he is. Got two quests for you, mate. You got any more for me? Welcome to Swift Solutions. Oh, he's got more tasks. Oh, look at all these tasks he's got. I can, I can, I can just get loads. I can turn most of these in again. I'm mint at these tasks. You can only take on 12 at once. But that's alright because I've got something to turn in. I'm so good at I'm so good at these tasks. It's unreal. What does it need? More of a night owl. That's it. 
I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna scout for new citizens. He's got no one. Okay. Well, let me get an item. I wanted that. That bone. Was it a twisty bone? Only problem is, right? I need one of them. I just want one. There we go. The only problem is, I can't even remember where that, where the higgledy was that required that twisty bone. Yeah, I'll figure it out later. Right, anyways, come on. We're going back to the story in Evermore. Evermore. Our oh, research topics are completely. So, what do we actually need to do? Obtain a spellcaster shell, middling meat, seven wyverns, and some hush be guns. Only two more of them. Yeah, and you get three tokens of gratitude off them. 28 off them, that's amazing. Yeah, hey, crap. Well, let's check on Evermore first. Huh. I think I want to expand our stores now, since I've got the money. Yes, let's do it. Influence is 700,000 or more. I'm nearly there. Let's check out our research. Ah, conditions of facility level 2. Ah, tell you what, level of facility, how do we do this? 4,000 gold, let's do it. Oh, it's looking bling bling. Now we've got no more money. That's alright. Come on then, Nial. I need wood. Lots of it. Hardware and timber, eh? Aye. I have an idea where you might be after. What you might be after. Reckon you could do a lot worse than an iron burrow through your tin. They grow over in the hardwoods there. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go and get some. Aye, that you could, laddie, that you could. But you'll not be wanting to go strolling in there unprepared, believe me. Listen. We blocked the path off a while back. There's a problem, see. A dirty great beastie with a few so short you'd swear he didn't have one. Uh -huh. And there's no way of getting to these iron bow trees than going through this thing. That's about the size of it, aye. Oh, you'll be needing this. Ah, that's to get that's to get rid of the two big thorny bollocks. 
floating our way. That's a wee magical concoction I like to call thrown away. Anything spiky I need getting rid of, this is your stuff. We piled the path up with puff burrs. You'll want to spray a puff or two on that to clear the things out. A chemical that specifically targets spiky objects? That seems unlikely. Thank you. Thank you very much now. Come on, Roland. We've got to set up for the forest right away. Research tackles have been completed already. Or am I missing something? I didn't even put anything up for research. How do I zoom out? There's nothing even researching. Oh, did I not set something down here? Did it be research? Nope, 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 nope. Game's lying to us. Oh, there's, peop there's people to speak to. Places to go, people to see. This guy. Mm. Wish I knew a bit more about wood. Mm? Is everything alright, Muriel? Not really, Your Majesty. I've got a bit of a dilemma on my hands, to be honest. My Lapgas told me that the fence from the enclosure keeps giving them splinters, poor little things. Of course. I said I'd repaired for them. The truth is, I've got no idea what material to use. I mean, is there a kind of wood that won't give them splinters? Mm. I say some fine grain lumber should do the trick. That sounds ideal. How much do you think you'll need, Muriel? Not a very big fence of five logs. All right. Five logs, fine green lumber, bish bash bosh. Yes, I'll get you that. Right, I haven't got any of them yet. Oh, have I? Hey there. I haven't got any. And there's a guy over here that wants to speak to us as well. Oh, it's this person walking around. Hi. Oh, it's Henny. Oh, that, that's the lassie fancies. Pardon me, Your Majesty, but would you happen to have a moment? Mm. <laughs> Certainly. Of course, Henny. What's the matter? Well, I was wondering if you might be able to help me prepare something for my next lesson with the children. Mm. Well, I'd be happy to. Thank you very much. Well, thank you. You're so kind. At the moment, I'm teaching the... Actually, no, it wasn't. The last we just spoke to Muriel is the one he fancies. This is the last uh, Roland fancies. Teaching the children how to tell different motions apart. They'll get in the fields and pick them for themselves. That sounds wonderful. I bet they love your lessons. Bet you the day. Well, I certainly hope so. After all, little ones learn more when they're having fun. Uh, so she wants to have a test. I've got to take a Gosh. test. <laughs> right, so you're going to help her with the test. Oh, and what's question one? This is a very poisonous mushroom indeed. Expert knowledge is required to extract its venom. Bring me the mushroom you think fits the description. Ah, uh, okay. I've got one. Yes. It seems like you're set to take my mushroom test. Let's start with the first question. Can you bring me one? Yes. Gotta be a toadstool, hasn't it? Huh? What's this you brought me? The toadstool. Looks like a mock toadstool, but very poisonous. Is this the one you meant? Yes. Bish bash bosh, I'm the toadstool master. <sighs> I was starting to think I might have got it wrong. I'm sorry, Evan, I have to put that face on. I can't have the children changing their answer based on my expression, can I? Toadstool is one of the world's famous and deadliest mushrooms. It's also the one the children need to learn about. They've been, they have to be able to know to avoid them before I can let them go foraging. Thankfully, I'm pretty sure all the children in my class are capable of identifying them by now, as are you, Your Majesty. Thank goodness for that. Now then, question two. This refreshing mushroom tastes just as bright and breezy as it looks. There's your description. Oh, then. Yeah. Can we slip me off? 
gotta be a mock towards Lana. Gosh. What a bitch. This woman's a proper bitch. Yeah. This refreshing mushroom tastes just as bright and breezy as it looks. It's got to be the glowing one, isn't it? Moonbeam. It's got to be. Mm. What's this, Evan? Oh, I've got it wrong, haven't I? Taste bright and breezy. Hmm. Gosh. Yeah, man. Yeah. Listen, right? If you didn't accept the answer. Right, we haven't got the right one, have we? Little bitch. Fuck your test. Actually, forgot what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, yeah. Forest of. Oh, yeah, we're gonna go and kill them, mayhem. Um... Kill the big spiky balls. Suck on my big spiky balls. Put them in your mouth and suck them. So we've got to go up there. These must be the puff birds now was talking about. Yeah, they look pretty spiky to me. I think you might be right. He said just a puff or two, didn't he? Well, here we go. Golly! Nice, golly, they disappeared just like that. Oh. Wow, they really did. That's some pretty niche product. Oh, a new area. I've been dying to get in this area since we first came here. Right, it wants us to go over that way, so let's go this way first. Oh, we'll probably find more rare mushrooms in here. That's where I'll get the answer to that quest from. Level 27. Right, I want to kill that big thing first because they're, they're nightmares. Oh, it's disappeared. What the hell? Right, we, c we can go up there by increasing them toadstools. But I want to look up here first. Three leaves soar away. Monsters in here. Drive out the monster. chance to use it? What the hell? 
I didn't even know where, where have I even come from. I'm lost. Right, so I came from this way. I'm gonna have a look this way. This remind <coughs> this reminds me of the uh, Dark Souls. Is it the Hollow Tree? I think that's what it's called. That leads down to the Ash Lake. Leave this to me. Oof. Deadly topper, tower toppler. Let me down. Right, so where are we going now? Um, straight ahead. I think this is just like a ring road, takes us right around that centre. Oh no, it ends here. Fair enough. Watch your backs! Introduction to destruction. These guys just got schooled, son. Yeah, and this leads back onto the road we came in on. Okay. Looks like we're going up there. Save point and a teleporter. Does that mean there's going to be a boss here? I think so. Oh, this looks awesome. Those must be iron bow trees, do you think? Oh, that's what they are. Oh, made of iron. Typical. I get you, son. Hey, they look lush, didn't they? Flippin' Crikey, these are the biggest trees I've ever seen in my life. Aye. Aye, and mighty sturdy too, by the looks of them. Oh, I didn't know his accent. These will make a boat. That can take a proper battering, man. Tidy. And we didn't come across the monster I nail mentioned after all. Look at us. I wouldn't celebrate too soon. It could be out there anywhere.
Oh, we fought this before. We fought one of these in the the Dreamers maze. Zag, dirty defender of the toughest of timbers. How is Zag? This isn't even as high level as the one we've already fought. What's he plotting over there? Oh, he fucking tried to body slam us. John, he tried to John Cena us. It's John Cena. Oh, he's went super flying. Oh, 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 oh. Motherfucker. Get out. Oh, he's going down. Watch this. That's it. Ultra finish. That's the blight of Bagday, hey. Yes. Now we'll finally get our hands on that wood. We better head over to Capstan and tell Ketch and the others we're ready for them to get started. Windy, ooh, windy cloud buster. That sounds like a gun. It is. Oh my god, the damage increase. Charge attacks build more quickly. I like the sound of that. You can have... You can have them. Haven't got anything better on the one front. You haven't got anything better on the spear front. Anything better on there? No. What about you? You can have that. And... He's got so much good stuff. Compared to what he had. There we go. And that's it. Can we go up there? Or is it not allowing us to? Nah. Invisible walled. There's no chests or anything here. Nothing. Nothing. Come on, let's go and tell Ketch. I got your wood, son. Got wood. What's that you say? You bagged a load of old quality timber from Forest and Nile? Core, you're a one you are lad. There's only right good wood comes from over that way. I can't wait to have a go on it. Don't worry about fetching in and all that. It's all part of service. Heh <laughs> heh. Hey! One. Right, you bunch of worn idle beggars. Let's get a move on, shall we? We've got a log or two to be shifting. I just noticed there's a half naked chip on the left. Get in. And just like that, Evan had found himself the finest boat builders in all the land. And some timber worthy of their expert attention. Eager to get to work after their recent ordeal, the men of Capstan set about putting together a ship fit for a king. And before long, a magnificent vessel that no wave could hope to topple was all but ready to set sail. Oh my! 
This is really ours? Hey, it's a blinging boat, like, look at it. Fit for a king. Blimey! Wow, it's amazing, I love it. Good. This means we'll be able to set sail for Hydropolis soon. Alright. Your Majesty, uh, me and lads were wondering. You'd not be bothered if we decided we wanted to go and live with you over and evermore, would you? R really? Aye. Building this beauty's put love up craft right back in us. With a few more like this. What? With a few more like this in us. If you'll give us the means to make them. And besides, you don't know the first thing about boats. You'll only go letting this one run racking without us to look after her. I suppose you're right. If you'd really like to join us, we'd be ever so happy to have you. <laughs> That's lucky. Because I don't think right he'll be welcoming us back now that we've jumped ship. <laughs> hey, catch us now, a citizen. She's all set to set sail, well nearly. We've to take her out for a test run and make a few final tweaks yet. Flippin' heck! What, so we can't go on a voyage right now away anyway? Sorry lass, she'll need final bit and bob doom before she's ready for the off. Arr, seems there's some time on her hands. Best put our affairs in order while we've got the chance, eh? Yeah, let's head back to Evermore and plan on yet our next move. Right. Hey, he's done an absolute. He's done more an absolute service building that boat. It was awesome. Um. So, what kind of place is Hydropolis? Do they have nice food? It's a nation built on the ocean, where merfolk and humans live side by side, and it's ruled over by a queen named Nera. As for food, I believe the fish is very good this time of year. Blimey. You know everything, don't you? <laughs> huh. Just how to read, that's all. I'm really looking forward to adding another mission to our union. Sorry, another nation to our union. And after that, and I shall be interested to see how other kingdoms are ruled too. I still have so much to learn. That's what I like to hear. Hey, up. Is this guy seriously wearing no pants? He's literally got just some tighty whities on. Your Majesty... She's all fitted out and ready to set sail. We've launched her overbite course nearby. All you've got to do is climb aboard and get going. Yes! That's wonderful news, Catch. Thank you so much. Alright, everyone. It's time to take a voyage to Hydropolis. I'm on a boat. Oh, there it is. Bling. Absolute bling. Leaf book. What's going on in leaf book? Master Pugnus is a change. Yep, yep. Hiding Geoseeker. Take a good look. Do you recognise this place? I do. So they've hidden something there, right? The Wandering Wordsmith. So that looks like it's in Hydropolis. Okay. That's me boat. And obviously that's the that's the wood we used to create. Okay. Oh yes. All together now. All aboard. Ah. I I just you know when you like try to do an accent and but you can't like even know how how it starts. All aboard. Looks like it, eh? Tidy. All right. Time to set sail for seas unknown. Hoist the rudder. Swab the mainsail. We're off. Yes, we're off. Basic of boats. You can access your ship via the field map. And once aboard, we'll be able to sail the seals wherever you please. And then, and even the odd river or two as well. To disembark, simply approach the coast and press A. However, please be aware that you won't be able to do so near cliffs and certain other obstacles. And if you ever use the travel spell to jump to a trip door, don't worry, your boat will be brought to the nearest bit of coast for your convenience. Ah, that's handy. At least we won't lose the boat. Now what I want to know is what this creature is. I'm dying to fight one of these, I've seen them. It's a goo. A level 29 goo. Oh, and actually jump on board. Nice. Oh, 
it's just such like it's like skies of arcadia when you're flying a boat and your boat on that and whenever you find a, a creature you always fight it on the on the deck of your boat oh this game's got it all where are we even headed hydropolis so it's right there okay oh i just want to explore though Look, we can go into all them rivers and go up that river into that cavern there. We can finally get to the cozy cave, cozy cove. Oh, there's so many places. That we can now visit. We can go to Starboard Isle. That's to be fair. I want to go there and find out what that creature is. I think in the next episode. So we've got my boat. Let's find out what this item is. In the next episode, I'm gonna to go to all the places. Hey, it travels fast as out. I'm gonna to go to all the places that I I've been interested to go to, and we'll leave Hydropolis for for a little bit. Okay, let's let's find out how to save the game. Evermore Castle. Yes. Oh, I've got a boat, baby. Yahar, mateys. Man the crow's nest, man the oars. Boom. Right. So next episode is just going to be an episode full of ship and sea exploring. It's going to be awesome. We're going to kill so many creatures and see some new lands. I can't wait. See you in the next one, lads.